to count. Let's do it. Our mission is to find out how many days we have been in school. The last time we checked, we had 59 days. So what would come after 59? I'm seeing a pattern here where there was nines, then there were zeros, but the first number went up. So it was 9, 10, 19, 20, 29, 30, 39, 40, 49, 50, 59. What do you think? Mm, 58, 59. What do we think? I think I heard you say it. I think I heard you. Sorry, my paper got stuck. 60. You are right, 60. So... 60 is a 6 and a 0, 60. So 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60. Look at us go. We have been in school for 66 and 0 days. S-I-X-T-Y. 60, wow. So whenever something changes over to 0, that's telling me that Oh, this is full of 10. There's 10 sticks in here, and we we can't have 10 in the ones column. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Wait, do I have 10? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Oops, I need one more. 10. So once I've got 10, then I need to change it from the ones over the tens. So I'm gonna bundle it up, and we're gonna call this a bundle of tens. One bundle of tens. One, one bundle, I can hold it like this, it's one. And we put it in the ten. So now, okay, grab it. Now we've got six and zero in here. Six, zero, that's why it's 60. Isn't that cool? Yeah. So you keep practicing. Practice counting all the way from one, to 60, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, that's counting by 10s, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, counting by 5s. Now you practice, you can count by 2s, you can count by 1s, just keep counting. See you next time.